Okay, we're going to look uh, quickly here at um, ATP uh, and what happens with ATP during the first two seconds of exercise first. And then we're going to move on and see how the ATP PC energy system resynthesizes ATP. So what you've got here, this is what goes on in the first two seconds of exercise. Here's our ATP here. What happens during the first two seconds is that um, one of the phosphate bonds is broken off. And that's an exothermic reaction because we get the release of energy. Okay, that's in the first two seconds. Any energy system, all it does is just resynthesize ATP. In other words, put back the P to the ADP to give us ATP, which is the body's own usable source of energy. And there's the formula there underneath. Now that's an endothermic reaction because you're using the energy from one reaction to put the P back to make ATP. What we're interested in today is looking at how the ATP PC energy system resynthesizes that ATP. Now with any energy system, um, what you need to resynthesize ATP is you need a fuel. And our fuel in the ATP PC system is phosphocreatine. What happens with that phosphocreatine is that we have an enzyme present, creatine kinase. That creatine kinase acts as a catalyst for that phosphate compound to be broken off. And that breaking off of the bond gives us enough energy to resynthesize one molecule of ATP. And remember, when we have a reaction that gives off energy, that's called an exothermic reaction. The second part of the coupled reaction in the ATP energy system, ATP PC energy system, sorry, involves the endothermic reaction. And all that is, is using the energy from the breaking off of the phosphate bond, phosphate compound from phosphocreatine, to join that phosphate um, back to ADP to make ATP, which is the body's only, only usable source of energy. And the formula you need for your coupled reaction is there. There's our phosphocreatine. There's creatine kinase, our enzyme. And there's the first part of the coupled reaction in the ATP PC energy system. And remember, that's an exothermic reaction. Why? Well, because it's given off energy. The second reaction is all about put, making that ATP by putting that phosphate uh, compound back to the ADP to make this. To do that we use the energy here. And remember because it's using energy it's classed as an endothermic reaction. All right, And that's what you need to know about the ATP PC energy system. How it uses its energy of phosphocreatine to resynthesize and make that one molecule of ATP. Okay?